Hey guys, this is Torno and today I wanted to talk about the Red Star stuff that happened alongside Maria Hill, what's going to end up happening to those people who opened six or seven Red Stars, and basically my general stance on this kind of stuff. So for those who don't know, on the uh, on the 23rd of July, when uh, Maria Hill was like a day or two before she was meant to come into the Red Star Orb, she was in the Red Star Orb for a little bit, for about an hour. It wasn't announced anywhere. It's just she was unceremoniously chucked in there. All of a sudden, people are opening the Red Star Orbs to get it. And then she was just randomly kind of removed from it. And that ended up with us kind of people not sure what's going on, people opening orbs when she was in there when they didn't want to, people opening orbs when and she wasn't in there because they just kind of dropped her from there suddenly. And then it just kind of ended up with a whole lot of mix-ups. And this is something that's kind of stereotypical of Scopely. And it's not the first time it's happened either, where characters have even been delayed to get into Red Stars. Characters have been in the Red Stars for no reason. People, characters are kind of shifted from Red Stars and stuff. It's just kind of all kind of a bit messy for some reason when they're doing this. Um, which means that people just opening their orbs. And so anyone who opened orbs during that time is going to be getting 100% of your orbs or credits spent back on the Elite Fours or Five. Now, if you did open a Six or Seven, they're going to send you through a mail to basically say, hey, you opened a Six or Seven, you can contact us and we will swap that for a new orb. So if you open a six or seven during that period, now all of a sudden, if you open like a seven red star and you got like a Ravager Bruiser or something like that, you can message them. If you've got a seven red star freaking Kestrel or something, you don't have to message them because you've got that already. It kind of gives you like a, a free re-roll of your orb if you wanted it to. Um, so there's kind of a like a big issue here to me at least which is that they've stuffed it up again which means that all of a sudden now people are either going to be getting extra orbs people are going to be getting extra re-rolls for their elite sixes or sevens and it's not kind of our fault this is on boundless once again for stuffing it up and their solution is here have your orbs back which i mean obviously there's not really a huge huge kind of way they can go about fixing this or anything like that, but kind of giving more orbs so people who opened it during that time, it's just going to end up creating them having more orbs. It's, I don't know what other solution they could have done. I'm not going to kind of um, try and guess like other solutions, but I'd love to hear from you guys if you thought of something that was better than this. But this kind of just brings me back to something that I used to hear when I was playing World of Warcraft, which was exploit early and exploit often, which is basically if there's some kind of stuff up, do what you can with it if it's on their end and it's something that you're not kind of immediately doing like for example the silver surfer thing if you're like having to do something very specific and very deliberately exploiting something then obviously don't do that but if there's something where they've stuffed up like this where they've chucked her into orbs open your orbs at that time and more than likely you'll end up getting compensated for it i know that that's not the way that we should be playing the game or anything like that and i don't exactly want to encourage it but the issue is that if I don't say for you guys to do it, then you're going to be on worse footing than people who do it. Like during this period, I opened my orbs, not with the intention of getting them back or anything like that, because I honestly thought that she was meant to be in the orbs at the time and they just didn't send out the mail for her. And now they kind of unceremoniously chucked her out of the orbs and then ended up now I'm going to get all those orbs back. And I feel bad for people who weren't online at that time to be able to open orbs. I feel bad for people who aren't going to get their orbs back or anything like that, because now that's given me more of an advantage for it than than other people, which I don't think is fair. Um, but I mean, it's on Boundless is the issue. Like if Boundless creates a scenario where you can get more resources by doing something, whether it's deliberate or not, then they need to kind of own up to it. And I don't know there's like, I don't know how they can kind of fix this without chucking out more orbs to people. That's not on me. It's not for me to decide how they should be fixing their errors. The thing is, they just should not be making these errors at all. Like, like I don't understand this. And this is not the first time. There has been a bug, uh, bug, error, whatever you want to call it, that has been in the game for ages. I believe that it is fixed now. I believe that it is fixed now, but basically what you would do 
for milestones. If you spend your milestone, like say your gold, at exactly the time the milestones reset, it would count for the milestone previously and the next milestone as well. So if I spent a million gold here, this was during the time that Emma was in there, it was during the time the symbiote Spider-Man was in there, when way back when Mysterio was in the orbs, uh, like in the milestones and stuff, it's been going on forever. So they could open like a thousand, um, sorry, a million gold at the exact right time and it would count for both those milestones. And it was the same with the lunar milestones, the lunar uh, milestones where you had to spend cores. If you spent those cores exactly on the time that they switched over, then all of a sudden they were counting for both. They ended up fixing that one by making it so that they were delayed like 10 minutes or something like that um, each day. So that way they didn't have any overlap. But it was the fact that that bug had been in there for so long and it was still in there for ages and ages and ages. Like I believe it's fixed now. I tried it the other day just so, so to see if I could get a video of it to test if it's still working. So that way I can say to Scopely, hey, this is still not working um, and it didn't seem to work but i mean there's potential that it does still work and i just kind of mistimed it it's just kind of ridiculous and it's this i'm not talking about like a bug that's kind of popped up in the last kind of patch or something like that this is a bug that had been going around since 2019 as i said mysterio had this bug and it was around for ages. And there was people who knew about this bug who were able to do it on exactly the right time. And then all of a sudden they're getting an advantage because of it. And there was nothing kind of, I don't think Scopely even like, or Scopely Balance even came out and said, hey, this is what was happening or anything like that because they don't like to talk about like exploits. And I mean, even if you did it like by accident, like, um, I mean, at times, like, because it's exactly 10 a.m. and it's exactly on the time that, like, the stores refresh and stuff like that, there was people who were probably done it by accident because you're opening an all, uh, from your stores and stuff like that. So, it's hard for them to be able to see exactly where people are exploiting. It's hard to kind of prove that people are exploiting and stuff. And... Um, I mean, it was just a part of the system it was around for so long. They'd been warned about, they'd been told about it. And if they don't fix it, then they really need to kind of look into that kind of stuff harder. I mean, what kind of solution do you come up with? Like for this, like this is stuff, this is an issue that they've caused. And now the way they're fixing it is chucking out more orbs. I don't know. Um, I've like, as I said before, I feel bad for anyone who didn't open orbs during this period, whether it was because you weren't online, whether it was because you didn't have any orbs or anything like that. It, it just kind of, it just reminds me of that thing. As I said, like um, just open your orbs when you see stuff in there and stuff. And the, it, it, I don't know. I'd love to hear from you guys what you think. This is probably an unpopular opinion. People are probably going to hate me for saying it, probably talking about it and stuff like that. But I don't think it's entirely fair that um, there's these kind of things that ended up existing or stuff bugs that uh, Scopely ends up adding in that people are then able to get extra resources from and stuff, especially when it comes to the elite orbs and stuff, because red stars are still fairly important and like silver and gold promo credits are still pretty important. Um, but that's it for today, guys. Have a great day. Goodbye.